Hey guys, Christian, drummer of Done For here, here with a rig rundown. Let's, uh, let's get down to it. So for starters, here on the hi-hats, um, I don't normally traditionally play cymbals like this, but this kind of cymbal works perfectly for Dunfor's music. This is a Classics Custom, a dual hi-hat top in 14. It's very uh, cutting, crisp, not as much body as the rest of the cymbals, but you know, they work really well. I'm a big fan of K-series. Pretty much anything Zildjian K is absolutely up my alley. This is the uh, the K-17 inch hybrid crash. Um, B-20 alloy, brilliant in the center, unfinished on the outside, sounds like this. So this is a Zildjian K Constantinople 20 Renaissance edition. Uh, hand lathed, hand hammered, uh, B20 alloy. A little on the quieter side, but it sounds gorgeous. And last but not least, arguably the workhorse of Dunfor's drum sound. It's been in pretty much every drum recording we've done. It's the Zildjian K EFX uh, Trash Crash in 18. You can use it as a china, you can use it as a crash, it opens up real nice, it taps good, it has a good bell on it, I mean, I use it literally with every show I play because it's just the perfect symbol and it's starting to actually show its age here, it's got a crack developing there, um, but it's just, in my opinion, just the perfect symbol. Oh yeah, yeah, forgot about the actual kit. Um, this is a Sonor AQ2 Bebop uh, in a 16 inch, 10 inch, 13 inch, and a 12 inch. Very small configuration. Um, I got Evans hydraulics on them to kind of help beef them up a little bit for this kind of music. Pretty standard, you know, but it's smaller. They're smaller in size, so they don't project as much, but their tone is great, especially when mic'd up. And we're constantly getting compliments, like pretty much every show, about how it sounds, um, given it's small. Or lack of stage presence, I guess you could say, because it is pretty small. It makes me look probably pretty big in front of it. Um, but it works wonderfully, and it's, you know, convenient to store and carry and set up. Hardware is just standard SPL, entry-level stuff. I don't, it's not a huge deal to me, especially because I don't have a lot of cymbals, so it's just enough to get by. And for a pedal, I use a single Tama Speed Cobra. Um, you know, in terms of single pedals, it's just cream of the crop, in my opinion. Nice and smooth double chain it just works perfectly these are the vader manhattan 7a's um typically seen in jazz and fusion settings but it's what i use because it's just what i've been using for years i mean it just feels good it's mostly weight towards the back not so much shoulder weight so you know it just feels really natural and i kind of i've always had a bit of a lower grip here so it just kind of complements that really well the uh throne here rock and sock hydraulic um you already know it hugs the ass cheeks just perfectly. I mean, little test fit there, uh, test drive. Nice grip, nice firm, comfortable stability. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and whatnot, please. <laughs> <laughs>